Sergeant Rock versus the Army of the Dead, issue two. Bruce Campbell writing with Eduardo Rizzo on the art. I did not read this, but uh, Matt read it, so yeah. take it away. So, um, you know, Sergeant Rock's finding out about these zombies, uh, and they keep attacking, and there's, you know, they're, they're proving to be um, difficult for Easy Company. Um, and it, it starts off with these Nazi zombies in a bar, and they're getting drunk, and they keep shooting at each other because they can't die. Um, and this is where Easy Company, they're, they're kind of peering in and seeing what they're up against. And um, Sergeant Rock's trying to put together a plan. And so it ends up with them coming across a, what they think is a regular truck full of Nazis that's actually full of these not, or Nazi zombies. And it ends up being a fight. And so a lot of it, this, this issue reads really quick because it's a lot of action sequences and not a lot of dialogue. So the toll, you know, Rizzo is really earning his paycheck here because uh, of the stories told through the art and the reactions. And so they defeat these zombies and they they find out that they're part of something called Project uh, Regenerate. Um, and they use their thermal binoculars that they got in the last issue um, to find out that they're being made with some kind of uh, technology with, with chemicals and and fire. And because they notice that the fire's coming in, and I feel like this is going to be the, you know, so the book's going to end with the big bang, right? Because if if they're using all of this, you know, gas and or, or whatever it is to make the zombies, that that's how you're going to unmake them. Um, but they notice this this car pull up, and it, it's got a shadowy figure inside, and the shadowy figure kind of threatens the the rest of them, and he goes, hey. You know, the Fuhrer is coming and we need, you know, supplies of this, this and that uh, for him. And the, the people of the project are trying to tell the shadowy figure like, well, you know, the supply lines, you know, the, the war is making it tough for us to do this. So kind of what we have is what we have. And the guy leans out and it's Hitler's personal doctor, Morrill. Uh, and that's where Sergeant Rock sees who they're dealing with and and that's where it ends is with with them realizing what exactly they're up against and then it's hitler's personal physician that is that's behind this but yeah lots of fun zombie action we get easy company you know blowing them up and and you know taking heads off with shovels and you know whatever else and finding out that fire is very effective against these zombies um so yeah no just nice simple quick read i like that it only took me like eight minutes to read but yeah, definitely if, if you were taking the first issue, this is more of that, just with uh, less actual reading. So I'll give this a 7.5.